Hi, welcome to another product presentation from TIS. This time we're going to be looking at our TIS 600 manual portable appliance tester. Um, obviously for people who are needing to do maybe smaller numbers of portable appliance testing. Um, and literally it's as easy as A, B, C. And I'll show you what I mean by that. So on the front of the tester we've got three buttons mainly A, B, C. A is for class 1 equipment, B class 2, C for cords and extension leads. The, others, the other buttons bring on things like backlights and allow us to change the voltage down from the default 500 volts on the insulation test to 250 if we come across things that have got surge suppression across the input to them, etc. So we can change that, but it will default to 500 volts um, as, uh, as, as you take it out of the box. So the easiest way to demonstrate this tester is to test an extension lead which I already have connected. Yep, it should be unraveled, but for the purpose of this demonstration, I'm gonna leave it on the coil. So we're all plugged in, connected, including the IEC lead, which comes with the tester to complete the circuit. So we just press button C. We now carry out an earth continuity test, 0.19 of an ohm, nice tick. Insulation test. Greater than 20 megs, another nice tick and it's done a polarity test and passed the whole thing. We do actually have the option to automatically store that information into the memory to be recalled to the screen at a later date if you didn't want to write things down there and then, which is a nice feature. All you need to do is remember which number the appliance was that you tested as it went into the memory. Um, and like I said, then you can do your manual reports then back at, to, back at the office rather than having to do it actually on site. TIS 600 manual portable appliance tester from TIS. Thanks for watching.